What's your name here? Chris. Chris, what's up? My name is Avery, bro. I got a question on Avery. Okay, how much experience you need to drive for Avery? How much what? How much experience you need to drive for Avery? What do you mean? Like experience over the road. You can come in as a new driver. Oh, uh, as long as you got, I think, uh, three months and up. Three months and up? Three or, or three or six months. Oh, three or six months. So you, do y'all take a new CDL driver? Um, yeah, they have classes. I'm pretty sure they do. They do, okay. Do y'all got a CDL program so you can get your license? I don't know about that. You man. don't know about that? Well, I asked my, ask, uh, my fleet manager the other day because my friend wanted to come in. Uh huh. And um, yeah, I think they do have classes for CDLs. Oh, they do? So. They train you up and get your CDL? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Okay, how much the pay is? Like starting off a week? Um, on flat bay? Uh huh. It's uh, 50, I think it was 57 58. 50, oh, 57 58 starting off? Yeah, no, it's, that's, a, that's what they gave me. Okay, that's what they, they gave you? Because I started off with the drive van first. Yeah, how much speed you had on drive van? Uh, I think it was what, 52, 53? 52, 53? Yeah, cents per mile. Okay. Yeah, and um, I had to work with them for about what, uh, I don't remember, like a few months. A few months. Then after that, uh, they had a position open. Uh huh. I let them know that I want to, you know, do the flatbed. It's my, you know, first time. Uh huh. So then they had an opening and they gave it to me. Would you home daily or over the road? Uh, I'm over the road. Over the road? Regional. Regional. I'm home Friday. Oh, oh, you home every Friday? Yeah, mostly yeah, Fridays. Yeah, uh, when I was on driving, uh -huh. only twice I've been home on Saturdays, but it's always Friday, Friday morning or Friday nights. Oh, all the time. Dang. Yeah. So, what states you usually be covering since you're regional? Uh, regional, Tennessee, Chicago, uh, Kentucky, uh -huh. Indiana, uh -huh. uh, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, uh -huh. uh, Virginia. Uh -huh. One time they sent me to Pennsylvania, uh -huh. uh, Texas, uh -huh. uh, Mississippi, uh, I think it's Louisiana. Yeah. Yeah. That one. We don't go to Florida. Don't go to Florida? No, because it's illegal. They say uh, the trailer's illegal to go there. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know. Dang. Yeah, then, um, yeah. So what's your pay used to be between a week, if you don't mind well, me asking? When I first started, it was kind of still summer. Uh-huh. So uh, I'm starting getting like 1300 13. after, uh, that's after taxes though. 1300 after taxes? Yeah. Dang. I'm starting getting 1300 uh, 1200 1300 but then uh, when summer hit, it slows down. That's what my fleet manager says. So right now, I've been just making like nine or a thousand, a thousand hundred. That's out of Texas? Uh, yeah. I oh, that's still good. That's yeah, ain't bad. And uh, I barely worked. Uh, they sent me home on Thursday morning. See you on Thursday morning? Yeah, they sent me home Thursday morning and I just started today. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, cause the holiday, that's what it is. Yeah. Okay, so is your record gotta be clean to go there? Like, yo. Like, you, you have speed tickets? Uh, no. Uh, your, your lights were clean when you got here? Uh, yeah. Okay, okay. I'm trying I'm to clean, see. But um, I think if you don't got over three violations or stuff like that, I can't remember much about it. But okay. Yeah, I mean, if you have, like, one violation or whatever, they'll, they'll, you'll get you them. Yeah, they'll get you. Yeah. How that, how that home daily account work? Like, being home, you know anything about that? About the home, home daily? daily? You yeah. need your hazmat to get that. You need a hazmat? You need a hazmat if you want a home daily, though. Oh, okay. yeah. You know the pay between that be home day low? You don't know. I don't know. You don't know. What year, what year your truck is? I think it's, uh, I think it's a 21. 21. I can look at Appreciate that man for telling me about that. So what what law would you be picking up? Like mostly lumber? Well, yeah, uh, we do a lot of tarpings. Uh, a lot of tarpings. Rarely, we rarely don't do uh, like no tarpings at all. It's always tarping. How much that pay you for tarping? 60. $60 of tarp? Yeah, oh, that's good. for tarping and uh, good. tarping is $30. How much you get paid for, if you had to wait for a load, how much you get paid an hour? The tension pay? We really don't wait. You don't really wait? It's always but, moving? But if it was a tension pay, I think it's $100. $100 an hour? Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, you mean like if... Uh, if you if you got to wait for... Just say they take a... Yeah, or, they take a while to unload you. Oh, um, after two hours, it's uh, $20 an hour. After two, huh? After two hours, it's $20 an hour. Oh, that's, bro, that's good, bro. 
Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Why, right, man? That's all like that's all. Yeah. Huh? It's pretty good. It's just uh, like I said, I only been flat bedding for uh, three months. Three months. You liking it? Yeah. Okay. I, it's better than driving because I get my exercise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Driving yeah. and that's that whole part of getting sweating there. Yeah. Like, fuck that. Yeah. But this is better, man. Yeah. Oh, they, they, how they training it? They training good, like the security part? Uh, flatbed? Yeah, for Avery. They they training real good? A flatbed, you go with the trainer. Oh, okay. You, you, Y'all you don't go through security class? For like a week. And if you want to, if you think that you're not ready, then uh, you go again for your trainer. For okay. Your how much your trainer pay you? Like with a trainee, how much you get paid a week out there? I was getting a thousand. You getting a thousand? I was getting a thousand. So. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Bad, hey. Man. hey, man, Avery sound like a solid company. That's good. I mean, I'm just waiting for uh, the summer because, hey, because I'm new to it. Uh -huh. That's they don't give me enough load. I talked to my, uh, the one that trained me. Uh -huh. uh, his name is Tom. So uh -huh. he's saying that he ain't got home on Christmas. Uh -huh. they've, been, they've been having him rolling out a lot because uh -huh. he's been with uh, the company for a while. Oh. He'll be flat bedding for over a year or so. Uh -huh. So maybe that's why he has more experience. They get more the loads, you know? Yeah, they might it might feel more comfortable with him. Yeah. yeah. What a lad company you drove for? Huh? What lad company you drove for? CR England. Oh, dang. Ain't no good, man. They ain't no good. Well that's where I got my CDL though, from uh -huh. them. Uh-huh. Yeah, but um nah man. I was gonna stay in uh CR England. Uh-huh. But then uh they lied to me, they're like, you're gonna be on OTR for a month. Then you come home for a week. Shit, I wasn't home for a five months, man. No! You went home five months? I wasn't home for five months. I was five months driving. So uh, I quit after that. I'm like, fuck that. I feel that.